Michael Kopech pitches for the White Sox tonight with three wins on the season, five losses, and a nice 3.92 earn run average. Strikeout to walk ratio has been unbelievable. Last time out, control wasn't where he would like it, but overall, the last six starts, the control has been very good. Bruce Bochy goes with Simeon leading it off at second. In the air to left field and in the glove of Ben Intendi for out number one. So it brings up Corey Seeger. First base, Andrew Vaughn on the scoop, Kopech on the cover. Nathaniel O batting third. He was in that fifth spot for a couple of games. Yeah, that's outside, ball four. So, well, that's a good start. A walk for Nathaniel. Adolis batting 263 after a, a strong night last night. He was two for five with a double. 1 1 slugged in the air to left. Ben Intendi back at the track. He's got room. Right in front of the old arrow. We're going to the bottom of the inning. And it's Martin Perez going this evening for the Texas Rangers. You see the left hander getting ready to make his 15th start this season. Six and three record for Martin. 12 home runs allowed. Ben Intendi. He's been good since moved up to the leadoff spot. His fifth straight game batting leadoff for the White Sox. Lifts this one into short left field Jankowski coming in and that's the first out of the inning one away now Andrew Vaughn the first baseman Andrew Vaughn smashes the first ball down to third base young is up his throw to first in time and another great defensive play by Josh Young at third base excellent reactions now he's been excellent over there all season long he's just a good solid player so it's this guy, Robert to right center, Luis Robert Jr. yet another hit. So Luis at first, here's Eloy Jimenez. A pitch to Eloy is lined toward the right field corner. That is a fair ball. It'll rattle around as Robert rounds third. And the throw to the plate is not in time. Meanwhile, Eloy all the way to third. It's one to nothing. Well, that is some great hitting by Jimenez on a pitch off the outside corner. He just dove out there and nailed a changeup. And just like that, the Sox lead early. Jankowski had a nice night last night. Back steps into the windup. 2-2. Two -two. Swing and a ball tipped into the mid of the catcher Zavala. It's the first out here in the top of the third inning. Here's a 2-2. Two -two. Yeah, that's another strikeout. That's the third strikeout tonight for Kolpak. And the batter is Marcus Semyon. Two for ten in the series, and he lines past a diving Vaughn and into right for a base hit. Corey Seager, runner on two down. That's their first hit. 3 0 pitch, and that's inside. Uh, uh, put him on, and the Rangers now have two men aboard. And he's up here with runners at first and second and two outs. Rangers trailing 1 nothing. And that's hit hard out to left field. Ben Intendi twisting back near the fence, and he was. It was in and out of his glove, and then up against the fence, he trapped it, and so that gets a run to the plate. Yeah, I think once it hit the wall, obviously, you know it, in and out of the glove, as you mentioned, but you can't catch it off the wall after any time, really, but it's certainly after it, it hits your glove. And we're tied up. Jonah Heim, Jonah popped out in the second inning. Kopech's 2-2. That's off the end of the bat, a little lazy looper into left field, base hit, and Jonah is on. Rangers third hit tonight. He grounded out to shortstop in the second inning. Duran hits underneath this one. Lost it high in the air. Deep out to center. That one is gone. A two-run homer for Ezekiel Duran. His ninth of the year. And the Rangers have their first lead of the night. You know, maybe aiming for the very bottom of the zone. Maybe below the zone. But that one was oh, closer to the middle third of the zone than Zeke didn't miss. We're going to work now against Nathaniel Lowe, who has walked and doubled. This pitch just a little bit below the zone, ball four. So Nathaniel Lowe on for a third time. It's the second time he's walked. So Lowe at first. Here's Adolis Garcia, who's 0 for 2. Here's the 1 2. Garcia shoots it out to right. That's a base hit. Lowe with a good start will head to third. And the Rangers have him on the corners with just one out. Little slider and off the end of the bat here looked like for Adolis Garcia. It is a big spot. A 3 1 game. You can live with that, but you're one big swing by Young from being kind of out of this game. Called strike three. Three strikeouts for Young. Only you can understand why he took this one. It'll be up to Jonah Heim now. 2 2. That ball hit hard. Deep out to right. Frazier is back at the wall. It's gone! Heim got 
second life on a pitch very close and then pounds one into the bleachers a three run shot that opens it up Rangers lead six to one send that man to the all-star game he absolutely deserves it he comes up big once again Sox need base runners and they need runs instant runs when you think about some of those hard missiles they hit early for outs another three two to Vaughn and it's golfed high and deep to left field way back there and it is gone an instant run is 11 and it's six to two not surprising he's seen enough change-ups on the night let alone in that at bat before he finally timed one and picks up home run number 11. martin perez embarking on his seventh inning of work 83 pitches deep in the air center field to Barrett's charging still coming he can't make the catch and it's by him Frazier starts those wheels into second base and he stops right there it's a double for Frazier that's the second ball in this series that Tavares has had all kinds of problems with he broke straight back as he came on to get it he just couldn't get it that brings up Remillard 0 for 1 with a sack punt Big hop might have helped Seeger. He writes his footwork and no catch for low at first base. So Frazier takes off for third and the Sox have two on. It's that in between hop that gets you. First and third, one out. Sevi Zavala with Benintendi next. Center field by Zavala. Tavares is there to make the catch. Frazier tags. The Sox do get a run off the error. And it's six to three here in the seventh. Now the White Sox are down to their final out tonight. Well, Elvis will have the opportunity to try to keep it alive against his former team. 1 0 pitch. And he goes after it. High fly ball, shallow center. It's Tavares coming in. He'll make the catch, and this one is over. And the Rangers have taken the series in Chicago. A 6 3 final tonight. And the big one here back to back solid outings from Martinez. He gave up three runs, but just two of those were earned in keeping the White Sox at bay and then the offense bouncing back after what was a very disappointing night last night and the big call that was made they respond Jonah Heim with a big home run for the Rangers tonight.